bought 33 shorts, you guys. Like, that's insane. I'm out there repeating from what I wore yesterday. This is so so it smells final rose. I just recovered from Coachella and now I have to do this again. Love this one. It's so cute. Hey you guys, welcome to my bachelorette trip prep vlog. Is that what it's gonna be called? I'm not sure. My bachelorette prep vlog. Something like that. But anyways, I I haven't vlogged in so long because I was so dead from Coachella. It literally took me a full week to feel normal again. The first few days after Coachella, I was so nauseous. I couldn't even stand up and like walk around. It was like really hard for me, but I finally feel normal. So I'm back and I realized I should, should have probably vlogged this whole process because I think it might be somewhat interesting and good to look back on. I got my hair done. I did a partial crown. Sorry, I just took off my lashes, so that's why I look like this. But I did a partial crown for my hair, so it was like really light on top. At the bottom, I didn't do because I didn't really feel like it was necessary, but the color is really pretty. I even trimmed it. I trimmed it like one inch, and I haven't cut my hair in probably two years. I think the whole time of COVID, I didn't cut my hair. Did I? Actually, yeah. Yeah, no, I didn't. I don't think I did. So anyways, so I did that. I'm getting my lashes done on Tuesday. Today is Sunday night. I'm going to fix my nails. These were my Coachella nails. If you guys saw, I love these, but it's time for a change. Since it's my bachelorette, I think I'm going to do like a French silvery white. I will show you guys. I need to make an appointment still, but... It should be, it should be fine. What else, what else? Uh, oh, earlier today I didn't vlog it, but I was trying on different like outfits that I was gonna wear. Oh, my arm's getting sore, so I'm gonna put it here. And yeah, the lighting is gonna be bad, but whatever. Okay, I'm just gonna hold it and um, do this. Anyways, I was prepping my outfits and I do like two of my outfits for nighttime, but my last one I'm not in love with. So I might try to go to like House of CB tomorrow to do a last minute shopping thing, but I also don't want to spend money. So my third outfit, it's like okay, but I'm like not in love with it, you know? And then my two bikinis I really like, but they're so similar. They literally look the same. They're like same, same, but different, but it's okay. I really like the both of them. So I think it's fine. I'm just going to wear it anyways. And I'm going to bring an extra one just in case for like um, lounging around the pool. Because we have a pool at our um, Airbnb that we got. But yeah, I'll show you guys that tomorrow when I like start packing and like putting everything away. Because I feel like I should do that just so I don't forget anything. Um, but let me show you guys what I've been doing right now. This was like such a long intro. I'm so sorry. But this is what I've been doing. So I had a cricket. I didn't show it earlier. I mean, I should have but I didn't, uh, I don't know why, I just wasn't really thinking about it. But I had these sweaters made because I've been loving those loungewear sweaters and I have one from White Fox that is very similar to this. It's like in chocolate brown and I've been loving chocolate brown. So I was like, okay, the girls are gonna wear chocolate brown or like brown for our trip because it's like Tulumi, it's like jungly, nature, earth, you know? So I went with that and then we're doing pink um, font here. I'll show you guys the back. So I made these and I picked it up like last week or two weeks ago. I had these made from my friend who actually owns a print shop, which is pretty cool. So I had these made, so it says Mel's Final Rose. Super cute. Um, I think that's what my hashtag is for the weekend because, you know, after the final or like the final rose from The Bachelor, you know, so I put Mel's Final Rose, which... I think it's kind of cute. I think that's the best that we could come with, come up with because I, I li couldn't think of anything else. But it's super cute. We're going to Tulum. I didn't, uh, obviously you can see it here, but I don't think I said it earlier. But we are going to Tulum. I'm super excited. I actually went in August. And if you guys haven't seen my Tulum August vlog when I went with the Aces, it was so much fun. So I'm so excited that my Liddy Gang group of girls, they've never gone to Tulum before or like, I think most of them, like maybe only one person has gone or two people, but they've never gone. So I can't wait. And it was either Tulum or Miami because it's like the closest places. My dream place is Ibiza, but 
it's far and it was probably gonna cost a lot of money and I just feel bad for doing that because we're already going to Bali for my wedding. Um, so Tulum and Miami were the second choices, but good thing we didn't go to Miami because they have a COVID like, what's it called? Like a lockdown time restriction? No. Like everything closes at 11, so we wouldn't even really be able to go out if we did go to Miami. So thank God we chose Tulum for this, but okay, so I've been putting stuff away. So like for here, here, let me show you guys here. So I have these packed up already. I might send some of these to like the girls in the bay because I think there's four of them there and I was just gonna ship it, like overnight ship it, but I don't know how much it's gonna be. And then the LA girls or the SoCal girls, luckily I saw one of them this past weekend and then James is taking two to OC and it all just worked out like thankfully I, w I didn't know what I was gonna do with them because I might have just given it to them at the airport but good thing it all worked out so I was able to get give it to them before because I wanted to wear this like in the airport and I feel like that'd be so fun as like your airport loungewear and then there's a one and a half hour to two hour car ride that we're gonna have to do and I, it'd be so cute if all the girls were like wearing this and I could like vlog it and stuff um but yeah you know me the extra ass ride so I did this for them and then I cricketed uh these I cr I made this on the cricket so it would match oh one thing that I'm like kind of annoyed about so these sweaters it was really hard to find a color because um they have low stock and I ordered three different pairs of brown shorts hoping that it would match this but literally none of them matched and this is the closest that it would come to and this doesn't even match like you see that it doesn't match at all but this is the closest and I think when you wear it you can't really tell because it's it's like covered like most of it and then in the light I feel like it's not that bad but whatever it's fine let me show you guys the other one mm, where is it oh Kilo's here hi Bubba you want belly rubs that's what you want okay so this is the pair from Amazon I got them from Shein so they were like pretty cheap ish but this was the first one that I got from Amazon and this color is way off compared to this one this one's like kind of ashy and this is just like so bright you know so I was like nope I cannot go with this one and I have 11 of these to return and I have two other Shein colors so I I bought 33 shorts you guys like that's insane but yeah I have to return these and I have to return the other one I'm not gonna take the other one out because I'm too lazy to show you guys but definitely did not look like this or this it was like it was kind of like a purpley brown anyways okay put this away this one is mine the white one I already did that but I'm currently watching Selling Sunset I love Selling Sunset um the drama this past episode was actually pretty crazy and this section of my vlog has already been so long and it's already 10 45 so I think I'm gonna go to sleep soon after I do this because I'm literally so tired you can hear it in my voice I've been doing two double shift days like regular work and then arena work Friday and Saturday and then I was like dead this whole past week so I'm pretty tired my voice has been like super raspy every single night so yeah I will see you guys or I'll finish this and I'll probably just see you guys in the morning unless I do something else okay Bye. Good morning everyone, or actually it's noon time, not morning. Happy noon, we're about to eat lunch. I thought I would come in today because I just returned all the Amazon stuff that I told you guys, or I don't know if I told you guys, but I was like, I bought a lot of stuff and then the colors were off so I just returned it. So we just did that and now we're back and we ordered lunch for today and I wanted something healthy so we got Mendocino Farms and I'm super excited. And after lunch I think I'm going to go to house of cb hopefully they have something for me because i'm not really happy with my third outfit you know so if not i'm sure somewhere on melrose they're gonna have like a store with like cute stuff so we'll check that out but here is my lunch i got mendocino this dainty was from the other day um justin wanted this what is this almond what almond romesco shells almond romesco shells justin got a new thing that's like a chicken elote oh that looks good that looks like toka, toka madre. Yeah. That looks really good. And then we have no, a cookie. Takaya. Oh yeah, sorry, takaya. Not toka madre. Anyways, we're gonna eat, so see you after. I just do my face. Oh, hello there. 
And I think I'm going to go to, uh, I was going to say I'm going to go to Opali because I just did a Coachella video. Um, I'm going to go to House of CB. I'm hoping there's something there. If there's not, then I'm just going to wander around Melrose and I hope the traffic isn't too bad and I hope that there's parking out there somewhere. Oh, it's already 2.38. I was supposed to go earlier, but whatever. Hopefully I don't hit any traffic. Okay, I'm probably going to vlog on my phone so I don't have to carry this. Okay, well, hopefully, wish me luck that I find something. This is so cute. Oh my god, this is so cute. I actually saw this online. You guys, this is the dress that I got a dupe of, and if the dupe was so ugly, but this is super cute. I kinda wanna try it on. Uh, it's so cute, like for an engagement party. This is the dress I kind of want it in white. It's so cute. Let's see if they have it. Okay, I'm all for this yellow dress too. I'm obsessed. I love yellow. Oh, that one. So I went to the fitting room to try on some clothes. This super pretty blue purple dress. I love that one. This is the Instagram ad that I fell for, but this is the real thing. I wanted to try it on. And this white dress, I really wanted to love this one, but you guys will see later. It's so flowy, but it just didn't work out. And this yellow one. This is so cute. This one was so pretty, but I think I could have went with an extra small. This was a small and it's a little loose. There's some extra fabric on it, but I think if I got a smaller side, it'd be perfect. Now this one, I really, really wanted to like. It was a little too long for me. I'm short. And then the shoulder part, it kept slipping off. I think maybe I don't have high shoulders. I don't know what happened, but yeah, it's a no for me. This yellow one, I was so obsessed with it. I loved this. I love a good corset, so I really loved this white one too. I'm just like a white corset top girl, but I had to get this one too. It's so pretty. And I went back to get an extra small of this, and this fits so good. I can't really breathe or sit down. I mean, I still went with it though because it looks better. Okay, I think I'm gonna get this, and this, and that. It's so cute. It's not even what I came for, so I need to keep looking. Okay, I just went to House of CB, and now I parked. I'm gonna go to Sorella. Um, hopefully I find something here. This is where it is or what it is. They're pretty pricey too here, so we will see. I literally left House of CB with three things that I don't even need. Okay, I already left. Didn't see anything. They don't have much white in there. Uh, so now I have to go drive around and see if I see anything. This is cute. And this, maybe I'll try both of these. I'm thinking you were made for me. It's in my birthday, yeah, cause I gotta say, you're looking like a gift for me. Wrapped up nice and neat, baby. Get in my way now, don't be shy. We'll be here dancing day and night. Get in my groove now, don't be shy. Cause I got this is some my favorite things. You could be the pop where it could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it you could be one of the things i love sunday morning breakfast with my bedroom door lock i like everything that has a cherry on top get on my list of the things i love 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 you could be the one i trust all the second chances they are nothing for us i like it on the cherry on top this is literally the set that i wanted for my birthday one year but this is a medium. It was from Meshki, and this one is like almost $200. The Meshki one, I don't think is this much, but hopefully they have a small in the back because this would be so cute.
I am home. I need to set you guys on something. I don't know what though. Did I set you? No, it doesn't work like that. Okay, hold on. Right there. Set you guys down. I'm out there repeating from what I wore yesterday, but it's okay. I just wanted something like loose. The only thing is I'm wearing biker shorts instead of denim shorts. But let's do a quick um, haul. Let me show you guys what else I got from House of CD. They're like, the bag is so cute. And I went to House of CD just for a white dress, a white bachelorette dress. <laughs> but I didn't even leave with any, any bachelorette stuff. The stuff is pretty expensive. But if you guys saw earlier, it was kind of cool that they bring you new stuff from the back. I think that's what I wanted to tell you guys. I had a video of it. Yeah, they scan it, they like write it down, and then they go to the back to look for it. And then they put your size down, and then they'll bring you brand new ones, which is really nice. I mean, yeah, I mean, they should. It's so expensive. They open it in front of you, and then they check it, and then they go like this. They're like, size small. And then I'm like, yes. And then they're like, okay. And then they put it away. But anyways, this is the first pop that I got. Oh, the sun is kind of awkward, but this is the first pop that I got. This is the only white thing that I got, and it was so cute. This one was kind of expensive, though. It's like $75 for this. But I would have paired it with my white skirt if I didn't find anything because I just think this is so cute. I'm still going to try it on to see um, what it looks like, but I'm pretty sure I have my third and last outfit. And then, you know, I'm obsessed with yellow. Yellow is like one of my favorite colors. So I, when I saw this, I was like, this is like a lemon yellow. It's so, oh, so cute. Looks like this. And for these, I got an extra small just because I wanted it tighter. It has ruching on the back. This is literally so cute. And this is not even part of my bachelorette prep. I'm just showing you guys. They went like this to me and they're like, oh, this is an XS compared to your other thing that was an S. And I'm like, yeah, I know. It's just I wanted this tighter, but this is so cute. Babe, look. Isn't this cute? Yeah. It's yellow. I'm like, this is so cute. Like, if we went on a date. So now we have to go on a date. We always go on dates. Yeah, but not nice dates where I can dress up. We just go like this. <laughs> yeah. And then this dress I saw from Sam Rayner, which is like one of my favorite influencers. But she was wearing this when she was in LA, I think, and it was so cute. This was kind of expensive though, but it's it's so cute. I had to get it. It looks like this, it's like a purple lilac. This is lilac or periwinkle lace dress. It's so gorgeous. Like. It looks so good. This one was so expensive though, two fifty five for this. Babe, look, isn't this so pretty? Yes. It's stunning, dude. And then it looks so good on. Stunning. It's like it's like fits your curves and stuff. Oh, it's like the little boning here. Oh, it's so cute. Actually, I need to do a haul. I need to do a try on haul for this. I love this. And she was the reason I got this because I saw her wear it and I was like, I need that now. Okay, so that's what I got from House of TV. Now my actual, actual prep stuff. So, got this. Uh, it's like a rhinestone dress. Hey, this are both. Looks like this. Like that, you know? And I already have a swimsuit, like, cover-up and stuff. So I just got this in case I wanted to wear it instead of something else. But I, I already really like those outfits, so I'm probably just gonna hold on to this if it doesn't work out or like for the future i'm gonna bring it and then i got this built-in bra crop top really cute and this way i don't need to wear pasties i could just put this on and it's like a top and then my dress or my skirt set that i told you guys about earlier i'll show you guys what happened but uh, it's from a place called dear monica and this is what the top looks like i got a medium size and I think because of the little rhinestones, well, I don't know what they're called, like jewels, tassels, they like kind of stick onto the top. So it causes damage on it. Like look here. Can you see that? I don't know if it's too bright for you guys to see, but um, but there's definitely like damage. Like this side is really bad. Can you see that? So because it was like that, I asked her if I could get like some discount on it or something. And at first she said 15, but then she gave it to me for 20. So I'm like, 
Hell yeah. But it looks like this. This is the medium. They only had the medium size, like I told you guys earlier, um, which is kind of sad, but I'll still make it work somehow. But it's really, really cute. I love the little tassels. It's like perfect for a special event like that. Then here is the skirt. And luckily, the skirt is a small because I feel like it'd be harder if the skirt was a medium. But this is what it looks like. I need to put them like separately somehow and like hide this from touching this because once it like attaches it to it, it'll rip. So it's like this, it's kind of like A-lined. It's called A-line? Not sure, it's like slanted. But it's so cute together. Anyways, that is what I got today and I spent so much money. Um, and now I think we're gonna go to dinner. And then afterwards I need to prep other stuff. So I will see you guys after. <laughs> Whoops, already started eating that. Thank you. Hey you guys, we are home from dinner and Target. I picked up a few things for the Bachelorette. Let me show you. There you go, bad lighting again, but whatever. So first up from Target, we got some band-aids. You know I'm so clumsy. You see this? And you see my knee? Yes, that was from Coachella. I got two things of Chobani flips. I love these. So hi, Bubba. Why are you so scared? Here is my baby. Huh. I love you. Mm -hmm. I got um, sunscreen spray or sun what's it called? Spray because it's gonna be pretty sunny and hot out there. And this, I actually. Can we even keep, put this onto the carry-on? Yeah. You can? Yeah, it's small. Oh yeah, 2.5 ounces. Bug spray, there's so many mosquitoes. Oh, that reminds me, I need to take my B12. Hold on. So I heard that B12 helps with mosquitoes, and I haven't been taking it as consistently as I should, so I don't know if it's gonna work. But I've been taking it. Hopefully it works for like Bali, I don't know. I need to be more consistent. It's not part of my batch haul, but we need more of these clips for our chips and stuff, and these ones are so cute. They're little smiley vases. We thought that was so cute, so we got that one. Justin wanted some wipes, so we got some wipes. And then safety pins for my bridal bow that I'm gonna probably make tomorrow because I wanna actually edit my Coachella vlog tonight so that I can post it and then edit this one right afterwards. But yes, I need to do a haul. I have so many videos I need to film that I haven't done. So anyways, that is all for today. I think catch you guys later if there's something else more exciting that happens. Hello you guys, it is the next day. I was supposed to go get my lashes done today, but I showed up at my lash girl's apartment and she forgot our appointment or she scheduled it wrong or didn't know what happened, but I'm back now. And now I have so much stuff to do tomorrow, so I think I'm gonna pack today because I was gonna do that tomorrow. I need to like try some clothes on again just in case. So I'm gonna do that right now, but yeah, I literally went to go get my lashes today at three. And I have to do it tomorrow at three, but thank God she had availability tomorrow because if she didn't, then I don't know what, what is gonna happen. I also have to go do my nails tomorrow too, so tomorrow's gonna be really busy for me, so I'm just gonna pack early. And that means I have to wash my hair today because after I get my lashes done, I can't like wash my face or my hair for 24 hours. So yes, I'm gonna do everything today and prepare, which means I got a lot of stuff to do today. Okay, um, I'm gonna change and then I'll show you guys my outfit from yesterday. This is my first fit, super cute. This is what I mean where um, you see it's a medium, so it's like pretty loose here. I wish it was tighter, you know? And then I wish the skirt was a little shorter. It's kind of long, you know, so I kind of wish it was like this or something. And then this was like smaller. Maybe I could tuck it in and hide it with like fashion tape or something. Make it work somehow. But this is the first fit. Okay, and this is my second outfit. I love this one. I kind of want to cut it a little shorter though, but it's like tied on these sides. So I might need to tie it before. Yes, this is my second outfit. I love this one. It's so cute. Okay, here is the, oh gosh, sorry Kilo. 
the sweater that I made or that I had made. Look at it. Mine is white. I don't know if I already showed I think I already showed you guys, but I haven't tried it on. Here is the back. It says Mel's final rose. So cute. And then yeah, you see it's like kind of see-through, so I need to wear those shorts on it. But I'm so excited. And then I have my Prada hat that I got. All right, you guys, I took a little break earlier because um, I was doing some stuff, but now I'm making my bridal bow, and I think I'm going to make a YouTube video on how to make this. I was too lazy to make it all, like, nice and professional looking. Um, but let me show you guys what I came up with so far, and I'll put it on the screen right now of what it's supposed to be. So the one that I saw and looked at, it wasn't going to be shipped on time, and it was a hundred and like twenty something dollars if I were to purchase it. So I was like, you know what? This looks simple enough. I'm just gonna try to make it myself. So I purchased tool from Joann's and then now I'm making it. Let me show you. It actually looks pretty good. And my little baby is laying on it because every time I do something, he just wants to go on it. Um, but this is the tool that I got. This one is matte and the one that he's laying on is glittery if you can see. It's glittery like that, but I went to try this one first just because the glitter literally got everywhere. It's all over the floor right here. I'm definitely going to fix it up, but I have this to just hold it and clip it on. You'll see in my YouTube video. If I ever make it because I always say I'm going to make it and then I never make it. Yeah, let me finish this and I will show you guys what I'm going to do next. Good morning, everyone. So it's, what time is it? It's like the middle, it's like noon. No, it's not. It's almost 11, but Ariella texted me today and was like, hey, did you get a package from last week? And I'm like, no, I didn't get anything. So I like went to go look and they found it in the back of the mail room. Okay, so we're going to open it together. But I don't know why lately I've been so emotional. Like every little thing will make me like tear up. But she sent me this card, right? And I'm reading it. Here, this is what it says. Mel, you're, you are beautiful. AF inside and out. Congratulations on manifesting the abundance of love around you. You deserve the world. I love you, Ariella. So freaking cute. And I like read this and I almost started crying. And then Justin's like, what is wrong with you? I'm like, I don't know. But anyways, let's open this. It looked like this. It's a cute little box. Actually, let's put you guys down to see. Let the adventure begin. Okay, why is this the cutest thing ever? Uh, what is is this a candle holder or a cup? Oh, it's a mug. Oh, how cute is that? Oh my gosh, there is so much stuff in here. I think this is a tote bag, maybe? And a pen. Oh my gosh, how adorable. Thank you cards. And a wedding planning book. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? Okay, I have one already, but I'm definitely running out of room, so this will be nice to use. Oh my gosh, and this is so cool. Like every day you can write something on it and like take it off. Oh, I love it. Thank you, Ariella. I love you. This is so cute. It's actually a really nice glass mug. Hey you guys, it's definitely nighttime. It's almost 10 o'clock. I just got home not too long ago. I went to go do my lashes at like 3 p.m. today and then I came home really quick, ate a yogurt, and then I went to go to my nail appointment at 6 and I had to do a pedicure and a manicure and I finally got home. I was the last person in the little shop with my nail lady literally just us two because everyone else left it was so quiet this is what my nails look like it looks really good in like a flash because it's sparkly on top it's like a milky and then a french outline with silver sparklies for the rest of the night i'm just gonna be like last minute finish packing thank god i packed most of it yesterday i just have like little things to pack now and we have to leave tomorrow at around six a.m. I think like leave by six so I need to wake up early just in case I have like last minute things to do but I'm gonna pack everything and just wear my outfit that I'm gonna wear to the airport and have that out so I just put it on but yeah I guess I'm going to end the vlog here and then the next one will be me at the airport or heading to the airport when I wake up thank you guys for watching my bachelorette prep I'm so excited a little nervous because I just recovered from Coachella and now I have to do this again. So, so I will see you guys in my next vlog, which is going to be my whole bachelorette vlog. I'm so excited. Okay. Bye. Good night. You'll find a different side of me.
The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah